into a Thursday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times crossword. Uh, I'm having some technical difficulties here with my recording software. So I think currently it's actually 10. I think it just turned 10. Yeah, but I grabbed the leaderboard a second ago. Uh, and you can't really see it, but let me switch to this. Sorry. Uh, yeah, I will get these technical difficulties sorted out. I just didn't have enough time to figure it out before I need to start recording. Uh, yesterday, the Glorp in true first place. P.P. Geckner a step behind Phil with a very strong showing in 36 seconds. KFS Venta, Bill Boris, and Marina and Tarotuna, Oriana, Stickers. Aerotangos today is in surgery, I think. So shout out to Aerotangos. Keep doing what you're doing. Um, Herman Chow had a rough go of it, but he's better at math than I am, so he's got that. Um, yeah. I guess yesterday, what was yesterday? I don't even remember. Gosh, sorry. A little, a little, <laughs> feel a little hairy today because I was trying to desperately make this thing work. Uh, like just a few minutes before. Anyway, that's all well and good because we're, we definitely have some puzzles. Um, so here is a spoiler alert for the Thursday mini. If you'd like to play along, then pause the video here, click on the link in the description below, and you should be able to access today's mini puzzle. Uh, it's always free to play, including today. And then uh, you can come back here and see how I do on it. Uh, okay, let's get into it. Two person band, duo, award, uh, chilly maybe? Uh, Boris and Yay. There we go. Nine second mini. Probably could have gotten Yay a bit faster, but I thought this one might be ache. <laughs> but it definitely wasn't. Yep, so two person band is a duo. Chili, shout out to uh, to my friend John, who got this the other day on the cryptic, although it was C H I L L Y on the cryptic. You should watch that video, by the way. I think it's really fun. <laughs> it's uh, Juan et al. solving the Wall Street Journal cryptic crossword, and cryptics are, I think, a lot more satisfying to watch because sort of a lot more, a lot more aha moments. URLs, od, wo, and achy. Okay. Pretty reasonable Monday. Nine seconds should be pretty decent. We'll see what everybody else does. Anyway, now for the main event, which is the, the Daily Grid, which today is by Alex Eaton Solners. Um, here's a spoiler alert for the Daily Grid. If you'd like to play along, then pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. However, the Daily Grid does require a New York Times crossword subscription, New York Times game subscription, actually. Um, so you need one of those. All right, Thursdays, I see some, some shaded squares here, I think. So these will be theme related. They all have six letters, I think. Six letter shaded squares in the middle of these grid spanners. These two anyway. All right, let's see what Thursday has in store for us. Let's get into it. Otto, Octavius, Beefeater and Bombay are gins. Shout out to Tate, Woes, Ills maybe? Movie Magnet, Marcus, entities with passed through taxation briefly and got into the swing, don't know that. Prefix for many ocean spray products. Cran? Yeah, Occam, razor handle. That's cute. Meet cute. Don't know. 22, 21, I guess that's in Tampa. Where we are. On Earth? Mother to the Titans. Gaia, I think with an I. Rhyme, pays, rapper. I don't know. Doesn't make it a lecture, say. On Earth from Sanskrit is Shri. What a pratfall may be done for. Oak in a nutshell. Acorn. The Big Easy. It's gonna be NOLA. Communist Party Systems. Uh, I don't know this. YouTube count. Views. Actress Anne. With 10... Oh, sorry, with 4 Emmy nominations. Mira, maybe? Some theater honors. Could be Obies, could be Tonys. Could be a lot of things, actually. Vassal's Plot of Land. Fief. Yeah, so I guess it is OBs, maybe. Program followed in Alcoholics Anonymous. It's gonna be 12 steps, right? But there's an F at the end of that. Something's going on here. Proper way to pass. On the left. <laughs> Sour tasting fruit. A stooge. Mo, maybe? It's flag display the curved out. Dagger, maybe. Oman. Nora, Efron, and team player. 
Agency HQ in Atlanta should be CDC. I think what a swish misses. Rim. Proof parts? I don't know. Judge of the Bible. Eli? May Day celebrant? Bedouin, etc. Arab? Tell it translate to Great Sage? Sing under pressure? Talk a big game? Change the Middle East, say? Oh, this is gonna be like dinar or something. It's gonna be some currency related word. Maybe. This could be Atlas. I think there's an Atlas in. Padme um, Amidala's home planet is Nebu. Orchestra section. Horns? Chuck Toss. Okay. Let's go back here. In jubilant fashion. Bug. Where magazines may be laid out. Uh, so this is not gonna be horns, huh? Dinar. That's what it reads. Way to go. Road. Apartment listing info. Newt Scamander. They may be set aside in collaboration. Egos, I think. Uh, Ice T here. Doesn't make their nods off. Hopefully, no one in my lectures overruns. Marcus. This could be low, I guess. I thought those were ills. Uh, LLCs. Got into the swing. Don't know. This could be Neville Shoot. Uh, but what is this going to be done for? Comedic effect. But something looks weird here, right? Uh, comedic effect. Something's <laughs> something's going on with those uh, shaded squares. Infests here. I think this is gonna be like Neville shoot. Part of a cabinet member. Uh, by blank by golly wow. Betcha by golly wow. It's not going to be a member, I don't think, actually, because the TB seems wrong. Proof parts. California is to palms, as New England is to blank. That's nonsense. Match before the final. Semi. It holds water. Props, so to speak. Something kids often lose. Like some glasses. Question one might ask when looking at a banana taped to the wall. <laughs> blank contendere. Blank McCheese. Creature, feature of a creature feature, perhaps. Some. Cowboys, QB. Tony Romo. Antarctica's blank sea. Let go. Part of Italy where Calabria is found. Okay. How come I don't know this one? <laughs> so something is happening here, and I need to figure out... This should be comedic effect, right? All of these crosses are correct, though. Com comedy? Effect? What? Of this? Comedy? I'm missing a dice here. Oh, to die. Die, die. Com comedy dice effect. Comedic effect. Dice in the middle, I see. So this is gonna be elves. Ah, uh, interesting. Twelve steps. Elves. Ah, uh, okay. So it's like ir irregular pluralization in the middle here. Sing under pressure. Ah, uh, names, names? No. Interesting, interesting. Part of a cabinet. Drawer. Ah, uh, me cute. Ah. Uh, Trope, trope. It's apparatus. Betcha, betcha by golly wow. Lemmas, proof parts. That's actually a math clue. California's palm, uh, with elms, maybe? Sour tasting fruit. That could be slow. That's nonsense. It's posh. No. Mom, poo. Uh, Maharashi? Is that what it is? Uh, gosh, I don't know. It holds water. Props, so to speak. Sing under pressure and or magazines may be laid out. So this could, seems like a oh, coffee table? But there's nothing there that's feet. Feet. Oh, 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 I see. It's going to be foot, foot in the middle. Because that's irregularly pluralized, which I, I actually really like. Props, so to speak. Is it art here for the banana one? Bug. 
irritate rooms here, maybe? Yeah, tow. Anti-fog. Okay, making progress. Ra the Ross Sea. That sounds familiar, actually. Let go. Feature. Of a creature feature, perhaps. Some. A few. Something kids often lose. Um, baby fat. So what is this? Apartment listing info. Something EA. Oh. In a jubilant fashion. Gailey, I think? Mayor McCheese. Okay, so this is gonna be name, it is gonna be name names, but man is irregularly pluralized. Talk of big game is a boast. Nolo contendere. It's gonna be gore. Uh, area, let go, can. Okay. Damn, and credit. Ooh. This Thursday hurt my brain. I, I was feeling a little, a little off today, but it went okay. Shout out to my friend Tate, who loves gin. I think. I'm pretty sure I've seen her drink Beef Eater before. I also like gin. Nola. Yeah, this... <laughs> so actually, I really like this theme, because one of my favorite things in the world is irregular pluralizations. Including, by the way, <laughs> Lemma can be pluralized Lamata. And this is a very mathy clue. When I saw this, I thought, there's no way this is a mathy clue. So I thought maybe proof, like, when you proof, a st like, a story before it be being public, or pu before publication. But no, this is a math clue. It would be, I think it would be awesome if they did Lamata here, but that's a lot to ask. I don't know about apparats. Uh, and now you're not going to be able to see me, but that's fine. Let's look up apparats. Right, right. Ah, oh, I see. It's basically French. No, it's Russian. <laughs> but is it just me, or is? Oh, I see. It just means apparatus, essentially. The functional processes by wh by means of which a systematized activity is carried out. So it's just apparatus in Russian, sort of referring to communist party systems. Interesting. Let's see, what else? Anne Mira. I should look this up. Okay. Let's look up Anne Mira. Anne Mira Stiller. Mother of Ben Stiller. Stiller and Mira. I don't know about her. But it is a bit before my time. I don't know if I've seen any of these things in her filmography. Okay. Interesting enough. It did get Obies. Oh man, this... <laughs> this theme on the left. If I didn't get that right away, then it would have been a bad thing. Slow. This came up the other day in a cryptic. Mo. Yeah. Dinar. Another time when you need to know your currency. Shout out to Jowen. Newt's Commander. I did see the first one of these. Yeah, pretty nice acrosses. Ser seriously nice theme. It's uh, It just took me longer than I feel like it should have. This is a cute clue for Occam. Razor handle. Handle meaning name. Occam being William of Occam. Trope. Shout out to Cat, who I don't think watches these videos. <laughs> but I think likes the phrase meet cute. Yeah, Shri. This is pretty crossword easy. It's a thing that one needs to know. I didn't know about Marcus Lowe. I'm getting tired of switching between the things, though, so I'll look it up later. <laughs> Neville Shoot. This actually did sound familiar. Didn't he write something that I actually have? Okay, I, I can look it up. Maybe I won't switch camera views, though. Let's see. What is 
what did he write that I knew about? I've read On the Beach. This is the post post-apocalyptic, like they're living in Australia and like the radiation is coming toward them. That okay. I, I did recognize the name. I remember that being a very good book, actually. Lemmas is a particularly nice film. I'm gonna have to screenshot that one for my year-long best math clues feature. Naboo. Another Star Wars clue. We had Leia yesterday. Reeds. Reeds. Yeah, I put horns. I guess you wouldn't even call them horns. I mean, you know, you'd probably call them brass in an orchestra, I guess. Cool. I, I really, I actually really like this puzzle a lot. Um, I wish I had gone a bit faster, but can't always be on your A game. I think I'm ruining, I'm ruining my brain by 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 getting into cryptics lately. <laughs> anyway, uh, for a Thursday, pretty solid Thursday, well under average. Getting close to that one year streak, so in 16 days or 17, depending on how you count leap years. But let's take a look. Oh, we got Ball Don't Lie with an early 48 second time, which I think is pretty fast. Um, shout out to you, Ball Don't Lie. We should write another paper. Anyway, hope you enjoyed watching. I'm gonna get the technical details ironed out next time, <laughs> I hope. Uh, if you have any comments about the puzzles, or if you did them and want to let me know your time, leave those things in the comments below. Otherwise, I will see you next time for some Friday puzzles. <laughs>